Arizona State women's volleyball played head-to-head -head against Arizona for the first time since both teams joined the Big 12 Conference. Yeah, there was a huge crowd on hand for this one as the match went into four sets. Our reporter Stella Tai has more on the hard-fought match. Wednesday night, Arizona State kicked off volleyball actions against their in-state rival, Arizona. This is the first matchup between the two schools in any sport this season. 4,630 fans geared up and packed their desert financial arena, setting a season-high attendance record and marking the fourth largest crowd all time in Sun Devils history. We got the swimming team, they're like doing their thing, running laps, some of the football players, tennis, like we had a lot of athletes out, it's huge. Yeah, I loved every single moment. It was so loud in there, I couldn't even hear the yeah. calendar set. After splitting the first two sets, the third one was the culmination of the closely contested competition. The Sun Devils rallied from behind and reached set point 24 to 23, but the Wildcats refused to go down quietly, sending the battle into extra points. Despite failing to convert on the previous five set points, ASU broke the stalemate at a 29 and 29 tie with two strong kills to close it out. Trained really, really hard, and you can tell because we don't. I don't. I never felt nervous during that set. I was like, I, we got it. We're gonna serve and we're gonna dig. The Sun Devils not only showed great resilience in this rivalry matchup, but their ranking also keeps moving up. After starting a season with only two losses and ten sweep matches, they are currently ranked 13th, which is the highest under the second-year head coach JJ Veniel. We really do try to focus one match at a time. Um, we got to grind away just like we had to grind away out on the court. The old time series between ASU and Arizona was locked at 56 to 56 prior to the match. This statement win gives the Sun Devils a temporary upper hand. What's more significant is that they put a stamp on their first matchup in the Big 12 era. In Tempe, Stella Tai, Crown Kai News. ASU improves to 15 and 2 on the year. Next up, they head to Lubbock on Saturday to take on Texas Tech.